Okay, so this, as everyone knows, this time of the semester is kind of hectic because part of it's kind of depending on which classes you're taking, but a lot of the times every class has some sort of project, some sort of presentation, some sort of paper, especially in my major, which is a, uh, it's almost like a hard science that nobody really acknowledges as such so a lot of the classes that I've been taking and have taken are those that have like a 10 to 15 page research paper where I'm researching a disease, researching a medicinal plant, researching an ethnobotany related topic or like this semester a uh, plant breeding project how to grow a plant in a greenhouse and with both of those breaking down the costs needed and what the budget would be for growing something or doing the breeding project. Um, thankfully I have this class and another online arts class that's kind of keeping me sane because otherwise I probably would be like losing my mind and staying up late uh, every single night but knowing that I have to make a like actual presentation in front of a camera but in a way in front of an audience is kind of keeping me like okay it's 12 a.m. I should probably go to sleep even though I may be like thinking, oh, I want to get this done, I want to get that done. I know that by the time I look at the clock again, it's going to be 5 a.m. and that's going to just mess up my entire sleep schedule. I mean, sure, we're all we're college students or uh, young professionals and sometimes we need to stay up late, but you kind of want to make sure you uh, balance your uh, health and your wealth. You know, like spending an extra two hours doing a research paper that I could postpone to today or the next day and actually be like awake during that rather than going to sleep at 5 a.m. to wake up at 1 p.m. and realize that you've lost most of the day and you want to go to sleep by the time it gets dark because you have an 8 a.m. class the next day kind of crazy and you actually have to like mentally be like okay I need to stop and then we go and then go on with everything and see what happens of course for me it's kind of funny because my allergies have been acting up so that's why my voice sounds a little weird and funny but luckily I took an allergy pill and usually it starts working uh, shortly after I take it, but this weather has been messing with the plants so much that if you, I'm sure many of you that have allergies have had allergies on like days that were like a random bright sunny 70 to 80 degrees and then the next day it's freezing cold and then your allergies don't know what's going on. I mean I can go on and on about these sorts of things, but this is a crazy time because I have allergies and all these projects to do, and luckily I've got coffee, as you saw in the beginning. I mean, I kind of don't care about the Starbucks versus Dunkin' kind of battle that seems to be going on, but I really wish that a $5 drink at Starbucks was more like a $3 drink because I don't really see a difference between the two.